With the early onset of hot temperatures, dogs baking in hot cars is becoming all too common in the Okanagan and it could prove fatal. The BCSPCA and the Okanagan Humane Society is reminding residents to leave your pets at home when running errands in hot temperatures. The cruelty investigator that I spoke to yesterday, the constable, she uh, had already attended five calls before noon yesterday morning. Reynolds says it only takes about 10 minutes for a dog to get dehydrated and into critical distress. Summer uh, weather here sneaks up on people and they don't think it's, you know, it's not July yet, it's not August yet, so it hasn't quite registered that yeah, these temperatures are soaring and um, they think, well, if we get out in the morning, it's not so bad, but um, in the direct sunlight, it's it's easily, you know, higher temperature than what the uh, temperature is saying on your thermostat or on your phone. Each year, the BCSPCA says it receives nearly 1,000 calls to rescue animals who have been left inside vehicles on hot days. The SPCA says even parked in the shade with windows cracked open, the temperatures inside a vehicle can become deadly. The Humane Society says dogs don't sweat like humans and can't release heat from their bodies as quickly as they can succumb to heat stroke and heat exhaustion. You know, 10 minutes is is plenty long enough and, I, and nobody would be leaving their child or their, their elder in the car for 10 minutes if it was, you know, 35 degrees in, in the um, mm -hmm. direct sunlight. Signs of heat stroke include exaggerated panting, rapid or erratic pulse, anxious or staring expression, vomiting, convulsions or collapse. If the animal is showing clear signs of heart stroke or distress, you're advised to call your local animal control agency, police, RCMP or BC SPCA. The RCMP is reminding the public that it is illegal to break into a vehicle. You're asked to wait by the car until help arrives. Madison Earhart, Castanet News, Kelowna.